Hi there, I just purchased this Wi-Fi dongle that is supposed to connect a computer or mobile device to a TV without any wires. Um, I got it on eBay here, $27 shipped. Um, I have a TV connected here. Um, the actual device is this guy. Um, it's just got a little extension for the HDMI. And then uh, has a separate power supply that plugs into a uh, USB, either any little device that plugs into the wall there, or uh, USB on the TV. Mine's on the side, so um, it did work, but just in case, and it's kind of in the way here, not a lot of room, I connected a separate power supply there. So um, you can follow the instructions, uh, this kind of garbage here, it doesn't really go over that much. Yes, it shows you how to connect, but all the information is right here as well. Um, you'll see your specific device name. Um, it's different in the instructions. I imagine it's different per product that's shipped to you. Um, basically, you just go to your uh, Wi-Fi and you find that device. You connect to it and then you uh, enter in your browser. Um, the address, the focus on the S4 here is not that great. There we go. Um, it'll actually tell you here which um, in focus. It'll give you command lines here, basically, which is shorthand of what the instructions are telling you. And this is what the screen will look like once you're fully connected. Um, and two options, you can switch between from this screen with this right here or there's an actual physical button on the device but it will basically switch you from DLNA mode to uh, Miracast. Um, I have no luck with Miracast at all and from my understanding that's uh, for Android devices which I am filming from an S4 but I'm trying to make a second monitor for my computer here. I have Apple TV in the other room and I want this Wi-Fi dongle to connect my second monitor here. I do have, um, you know, it connected this way, but I'd like to be able to uh, disconnect my laptop and have the TV connected wirelessly. Um, I have it all connected here, and I'm, um, let's see, as you can see here, uh, I'm connected. Um, my wireless are these two right here, these two options. Uh, the device is connected via here. My router is putting out both of these. Um, so let's go over to the system preferences. Click on display. Um, now here under AirPlay displays, you can see I do have uh, this. I don't know why my Apple TV is not showing up. Maybe because it's sleeping, although while I've been messing around with this it has shown up. So I'll click on this and it should connect. It's, I guess, trying right now, but it's going to get an error message. It won't actually connect. And the TV won't change either. So, I'm fully connected between the TV and the computer. There's, the two of them are not, you know, um, the computer's not putting out a video signal to the TV, and the TV's not receiving one. So, this is sort of a video of my information up until this point and now a question of uh, what do I do from here? I'd like to um, get this resolved. So any information you have as to what's going on would be appreciated and just to be thorough um, as far as firewall goes, um, firewall options. I tried this with it off and I uh, tried it with it on and from what I read online, if it's your firewall's on, you definitely want to have this uh, selected, which I do. And it made no difference having a uh, firewall on or off for connecting. It just did not work. So, you know, obviously another way, when you have this option checked there, you can just go up here and, uh, you know, you should be able to connect right here. It's the exact same as connecting over here. And I'll get the same error message in a second. Okay. So, that's that. Please let me know uh, if you know more than I do. 
Um, I'm guessing at this point there's just not a whole lot of support for devices like this for Mac. Um, it says that it should handle AirPlay, but really there's just uh, DLNA or Miracast as an option from this product, even though on eBay it says AirPlay as well. And in the instructions, it says this works for Mac on the other side. Same operation on Apple, Mac, iPad, iTouch, iPhone to use the DLNA function. Oh, what's that? I'm on the DLNA function and it's not working. Even though it says it's connected. Okay, let me know. Any help? Thanks.